What's going on everybody? This is Dwayne Shoots Toys and in this video I'm gonna give you a tour of my mini Jordan sneaker collection. I've got a bunch of these 1-6 scale Jordans from 1s all the way through 13s in a variety of colorways and obviously I can't wear these on my feet but I can use them with my toys and that's the main reason I bought them. I do a lot of toy photography shots using these sneakers and if you want to see them in more detail you can check them out on my Instagram at Dwayne Shoots Toys. Now before I get into the review, I know a lot of people are going to ask me where do I get these sneakers. So I will answer that for you right off the bat. There are lots of places to get them online. If you go to eBay and search for 1 6 scale sneakers, you should be able to find some. And if you go on Instagram, there are lots of sellers like Mad Exo Sneakers, Mini Sneaker Shop and Kicks Mini Official. Alright, let's get into it and start by looking at the ones. Now I've got a few different colorways here. We'll take a look at the off-whites. And the cool thing is that they really managed to capture a lot of the major details of the sneaker. You know, we've got the writing here on the sides. You've got the tag. Even on the swoosh you have those little blue stitches. You've got the air and if you open this up, you've got that 85. And I've got a couple of popular colorways here, the band bread and the bread toe. Uh, forgive me if I get any of these names wrong. Feel free to correct me in the comments. And I just got these ones in last week. These are the Travis Scott ones. Got them from Mad Exo Sneakers. And uh, these ones have a little bit more detail than some of the other ones because you can see they have the Nike Air on the inside of the shoe as well. And if you take a close look at the back, you can see the little logo. So that's pretty cool to see. And you obviously have the reverse swoosh on this side and the regular swoosh on that side. So that's it for the ones. Next we have the twos and I only have one pair of twos. It's this white colorway with the red and black accents. Now these are all made out of uh, plastic. so. They're uh, solid, it's not leather, but uh, on many of these shoes, the laces are actual uh, cloth kind of laces, so pretty good detail. Next up, we have the threes. I've got the stealth colorway here, gray with uh, black and red accents. And I also have the black cement threes, but I think some of the colors are a little bit off on this one. There should be gray on the tongue and, and the top there. But uh, other than that, pretty good looking shoe. And we've got the Nike Air on the back and the Jumpman on the back of the Stealth shoe. Next up we have the fours and for the bread colorway I was only able to get one shoe because they were in such high demand that uh, it was difficult to find a complete pair online. But this is still a great looking shoe. And I also have the red Toro Bravo sneakers as well. Then we have the fives, which I really like. Uh, these are the grapes. Uh, they also released a version called the Fresh Prince that didn't have the laces on them. But uh, yeah, you get the white, purple, and green. Really cool shoe. And these laces were made out of plastic. Not the same lace material as some of the other shoes. Now for these ones, I actually took the laces out because I used them for a Fresh Prince photo shoot. And uh, on the show, Will was known for sometimes wearing his Jordans without laces. And if you look at the bottom here, they've got a lot of detail. They got that clear material and the Jordan on the bottom. I also have the black metallic colorway. Really cool looking design with the jump man on the back. Next up, we have the black infrared sixes. I remember these came out when I was in elementary school and they were super popular. All the kids wanted to have them. I really love this design. Got the air pocket here. I also have a pair of sevens. 
This is the Olympic for the love of the game. Got the number nine on the back. It's a white shoe with some blue and red on it. Next up are the eights. We got the aqua colorway, black with purple and blue. A little splash of yellow and red too. And the playoff colorway, black with uh, red and blue, a few other colors there. Next up are the nines. We got this red colorway, the motorboat Jones. We got the black bottom. And this one has a hole in it because it was a keychain. I just took the keychain part out and used them with my toys. And you have some real laces as well on this one. Next up are the tens. I've got this white colorway with some black and red accents. We got the number 45 on the side there. The jump man on the back and a red and black pattern on the bottom. Next up are the 11s. Now these are a really popular design. We got the Concord white uh, Jordans here. Um, if you look on the bottom, you have that clear material and the purple. Uh, I got a little bit of red dye on here from a project that I was working on in the past. And we have the black and red pair, really cool looking shoe. I've used these quite a bit in my toy photography. In this shot, we have Mario wearing the Concords as he dunks on Luigi. And here we have Michael Jackson and Michael Jordan. And Michael Jackson is holding the black pair of 11s. And then we have the 12s, the uh, flu game colorway, black, red, uh, again, this one has a hole in the back because it was a keychain. Uh, you got the Jordan on the back, 23, little jump man. And again, these laces are plastic, not the uh, lace material. And finally, we have the 13s. We've got the white He Got Game colorway. Lots of cool details on the bottom and on the side. And I have the black and red colorway as well. Again, lots of detail all throughout. And in the process of taking these photos, I've built a lot of accessories myself, including these boxes. Got a bunch of different designs and these are just made out of paper. And these are just a nice added touch to the dioramas. They complement the sneakers pretty well. So that's it. I just wanted to give you a quick tour of my Jordan collection. And if you want to see more of my photography, again, you can go to Dwayne Shoots Toys on Instagram, Twitter, or Facebook, or visit my official website, DwayneShootsToys.com.